students at Davidson, keeping my schedule organized is quite difficult. I'm always so overwhelmed by the tasks on my calendar. And our solution to that is a mobile goal completion app, Primally. Hi, my name is Heidi Zakin, and my favorite feature of our app is our unique and amazing graphics. These attract the audience of student aged individuals. We reduce stress and promote productivity by prioritizing short term goals. I'm Oscar, the head programmer for Plannerly. While designing Plannerly, I used MIT App Inventor, which is a block coding platform. Today I'll walk you through the design and functionality of our app, and explain how each item was made. We'll start off with the plus button, which is how you switch over to your add menu. Once I click on the plus button, I can add any new classwork or activities that I need to get done. Say I need to do algebra homework, clean my room, and finish an essay draft that I'm working on. Once I've got those in there, I can pick a time that they need to be done. These selectors let you pick any time of day that you could possibly need to finish an activity. But what if three isn't enough? I can always click the plus button and add another thing, like sending some notes. I can pick a time for that too. Now that I've got four activities, I might not need all of them. Maybe I've already finished my algebra homework. I can just click this check mark here and it will be deleted. Once I head back to the home page, Plannerly will create a clean to-do list for you to check off. And once your due times are reached, Plannerly will send a notification telling you that you need to get finished. Now that I've covered everything Plannerly can do, let's head over and check out the code. So now I'm in MIT and I've got open our home page code. It's got two simple sections. The first section is the exit button. The second section is the initialize section, which brings up the to-do list and shows you everything you need to get done. So now, I'll switch over to our Add Menu. So now I'm in the Add Menu, and I'm just going to run through all of the things real quickly so we cover everything. This is the Add Box button, which will just insert another box underneath the ones you've already made. Right here we have the Time Pickers, um, and, and this code will select what time to display based on what the user inputs. Over here we have the delete button code which comes in two parts. The first is when you click that trash can. It displays the checkboxes and shows the bigger check button. Over here we have the bigger check buttons code which determines how many things you need to delete and adjust the variables and everything to align with that. Thank, Thank you for, for considering, considering our, our app submission. submission.